Welcome to Odd Couple Survival. On this episode, we have survival expert Ross Smith and trailer trash Tammy. Oh! Start up, cowboy! The rules are simple. Each survivalist is allowed to bring three primitive items and nothing else. With their tools and expertise, they will have 24 hours to survive in the wilderness. Let's meet our contestants now. My name's Tammy, and I'm a badass bitch. And these are the three items I chose to bring, okay? Brought them from home. Number one, motor oil, okay? Number two, cream cheese. You can't go wrong with that. And a Better Homes and Gardens magazine. What the f were you thinking? How the f are we gonna use those items in survival? Well, spank bank, we're gonna get bored. We'll be out there 24 hours, okay? You can't go wrong with motor oil. You need it. We don't it even have a vehicle. We don't have a motor to put the, the oil in. I use it for other stuff, okay? You don't have to have it for a motor. It can be used for anything. Oh my goodness. Lotion, fire starter. It does, no, what the? And cream cheese. You cream got it. Cream cheese. You gotta have, that was my number one pick. You gotta have cream cheese. What are you gonna put the cream cheese on? You don't have a I've, got a I've got a million things I can think of right now to use this cream cheese for. Turn the camera, turn the camera off. What are you doing? You're supposed to be taking this serious. I am taking this serious. I brought cream cheese. What's up everybody? I'm survival expert Ross Smith and today I got to choose three items from home to help me with my expedition with Tammy. First item I brought was um, something that can help us build shelter and get food. This is really important. This is a state-of-the-art machete. It's really good. It's going to come in handy later. The second item I brought out here today is probably the most important for this cold, dry climate. It's about 10 degrees out here, so I decided to bring matches. Not only can you keep warm, but you can cook the food that we use with our machete. We can also boil water. The most important thing, I should say, water. I brought us both water. I think we're going to need this. We've got to stay hydrated. We've got a big hike. We've got to get to our extraction point later, so this is going to come in handy. We've got about a gallon here. Um, so I think with these three things, um, we're going to do just fine. All right, guys, we're about ready to go on our journey. We're only taking six items total. That's it. We're pretty much just taking exactly what's in this backpack and nothing else. It is 12 degrees outside, as you can see that. The climate is against us. All the odds are against us, but we're going to knock this out with our survival skills. You ready to go? Mm -hmm. So what you're saying is all we can take in the wilderness is what? The three items we pick? Damn straight. Okay. Yeah, I'm ready. All right, let's do this, baby. I can't do this. It's too cold, I can't do this. Listen, listen, it's okay. Let's we turn around. What's up with, this was a mistake. Let's no, turn around. Not. We're here. The helicopter's gone. We got 24 hours, we gotta survive. It's easy. 24 hours? What'd you think it was? <laughs> Did you sign the papers? I thought, I don't know what I thought. I wasn't thinking when I signed up for this. We've only walked 50 yards, give it a chance. We can walk 50 yards back and wait for somebody. But no one's there, they're gone. Yeah, it's cold. All right, let's walk, it'll warm you up. <sighs> it's cold, kind of reminds me of the deep freeze at work. You know, I just gotta keep thinking about that, you know? Where do you walk again? <sighs> What's your I don't even know anything about you, honestly. D Denny's. I plan on leaving the hunting and shelter and everything to you. I don't have any military experience. I had abusive parents as a kid. Yeah, that's probably not gonna help in a survival situation. I bet you damn well it will. All right guys, so the plan is we're gonna climb up this mountain right here, build a shelter up there, and try and uh, get a good view of some type of running water so we can get some water, get a fire started, because it is freezing out here, and... What are you doing? Popping a cold one? Where'd you get a beer at? Don't worry about it. Why would you pop a cold one when it's 12 degrees out? Everybody knows this is what you do in times of stress. We need to get to the top of the mountain to get shelter and stay warm, and you're popping a cold one. Go build a shelter. I'll be there in a minute. Okay, guys, we finally got to our shelter. We had a big hike. It's getting cold out, and uh, I found this perfect place because we got this log here, and we're going to stack sticks for a shelter. And it... Hey, could you help get some logs so we get this started? No. What do you mean? I'm gonna play Tetris for a while. Where did you get a phone at? I brought a phone with me. I'm gonna play Tetris. We had three primitive items. 
And you have a phone. I snuck a phone. Here we go. Yo, what are you doing? You're gonna make me lose. Oh my gosh, we just climbed up the mountain and we need to get shelter before it's Yeah, dark. we climbed up the mountain, okay? I need to take a rest, all right? We climbed up the damn mountain and you wanna build right off the bat. You don't even give me a five minute breather. I gotta play Tetris to unwind. There's not a five minute You're breather. You're gonna make me lose. How did you get a phone up here? I snuck it, okay? You're gonna learn a few things from me. So right now we're gathering a bunch of wood so we can try and get this fire started before it gets dark. I can't do no more. It's not good for my gonorrhea. That's all you're gonna get. Let's get a fire started. Tammy, I can't get the fire going. The wood's too wet. Huh. Really? Huh. I got something here that'll help with it. You wanna apologize, hmm? Is the Better Homes and gar Gardens stupid now? Huh? Huh? Thank you. You're right. Get the fire started. You're right. Okay, I'm not gonna lie. Ross is pissing me off, okay? He's a know-it-all and he's kinda rude. All right, talking down to me like I don't know anything. Like, ooh, you know, you're, you're a survivalist. You think you're better than everybody else? You're not, okay? I know what I'm doing. I'm just not gonna do it. Okay, because he's he's gonna do it. Why would I why would I build a fire? Okay, when he's doing it. But I'll tell you right now, he better cut the attitude. Okay? I'm not gonna do, deal with this for another 23 hours. I refuse to. You can tell production. Tell him. Alright, we need to figure out this spooning thing. Who's on uh, you on front or back? It doesn't matter, Tammy. Just whatever you want to do. I like one on each side, but we can't do that tonight. I don't know what kind of lifestyle you live, but it, it really... It's a fun lifestyle, I'll tell you that. Yeah. Well, it's not fun surviving. <clears throat> I sense some animosity. Hmm? Yeah. Is it because I have threesomes? Damn it, Tammy! The magazines were a great idea, but the, the wood's too wet. We can't have a fire tonight. Here, throw a Tide Pod on it. Why do you have Tide Pods? I brought them as a snack. Who eats Tide Pods? They're I, for laundry. I've never had one, okay? People are eating them nowadays. I figured we're out here trying new things. I figured we'd explore new foods. And it doubles as a fire starter here. I'm not eating a Tide Pod. Okay, put it on the fire. It's not going to do a damn thing. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Tammy, I can't mm -hmm. believe it worked. Mm -hmm. A damn Tide Pod, it, it, it smells delicious out here. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Oh my gosh, I owe you. I, you're, you're, I can't believe you're right. What'd I tell you, bitch? All right, well, honestly, the fire looks good. I don't think we have time to do a shelter. It's pitch black. I can't see a thing. Um, I wouldn't mind getting some shut-eye before, you know, so we can get a, a, a good start on mm -hmm. tomorrow. Yeah. So if you wouldn't mind just laying down over there. and Over we'll there? Buck up. Yeah. I don't think so. <sighs> We're keeping warm. I got your back, and in an hour, we can switch. You can spoon me, okay? Why is your hand on my crotch? Everybody knows the crotch region is the warmest part of the body. Okay? You can put your hand on mine. Tammy, I thought we weren't making this sexual. We were trying to survive. All right, guys, we just got out. Maybe got a couple minutes of sleep so far. This has got to be the worst night's sleep of my life. Worst. Yeah, and uh, it's probably minus temperatures. We don't have a shelter. Our fire is going out, and I keep hearing noises out in the woods. Um, you're not hearing noises out in the woods. That's me farting. That's no, no, what you're hearing. No, I really heard something out, out there far. No, it's echoing. That's what it's doing. So that's what you're hearing. All right, guys, we got up again. We are freezing. The fire is going out. You can see my breath right now. It's cold out here. And we yeah, need, he is cold. Get your freaking hand off me. So we need to implement a new survival technique. And that is working out, getting the blood flow. Hold, hold on, wait. Working out? I'm not working out in the middle of the night when I'm supposed to be sleeping. Tammy, do you want to die out here? No. Then we got to work out. Come on, get up. What All right, hell? Richard Simmons, damn. All right, guys. Doing jumping jacks is one of the best exercises you can do because it gets the blood flowing to all your limbs. So me and Tammy will... Tammy, what the f*** 
are you doing? I'm getting my blood flowing. What is that? It's a hopscotch. Where did you get a hopscotch? Oh, I've had this thing for years. Guys, I just got up and Tammy's not here. She was just there earlier. I'm freaking out. I'm worried about her. I keep hearing noises out there. There's predators out there. Tammy? Yeah. What are you doing? Eating chips and pizza. You're telling me you've had chips and pizza this whole time when you offered me Tide Pods earlier to eat. I didn't have it this whole time. I just got it. Where did you get chips and pizza? Okay, don't worry about it. All right, Mr. Survival Expert. Don't even know how to get chips and pizza in time of need. Who's the expert now? You made me eat f***ing Tide Pods! You're going to learn from the best. What's up, guys? I just got up. Didn't sleep a second last night. Super tired. It's super cool, but if we want to survive, we got to get moving. And also, I noticed that when I got up, Tammy has a fur coat on. Tammy, wake up. Tammy, wake up. What time is it? How did you get a fur coat <coughs> in the middle of the night? Killed a wolf. Tammy? Mm. There aren't any wolves out here. Then what the hell did I kill? I killed something. I don't know. And how did you kill it? Uh, I used the hopscotch and the Tide Pod. You're meaning to tell me, in the five minutes you snuck away last night, you killed a wolf uh -huh. with a hopscotch and a Tide Pod, yeah. and then you managed to sew it into a coat. Yeah, I brought my sewing kit, too. It's warm. Get over here. Get up. Huh? I, I don't know. I don't know what to do with this shit. Wait, you're you're pissed that I made us a, a fur coat? Us? I'm sitting over here freezing my ass off on the other side of the it's big fire that for, doesn't exist. It's big enough for both of us, Ross. Can't believe you're pissed that I freaking killed a. I thought you'd be proud of me. I thought you'd be proud that I killed a wolf. I am proud, but it doesn't make any sense. We're out here in the cold, and it don't make no sense to kill a wolf for its skin. There's no wolves out here, Tammy. What I kill then? I don't know. Whatever it is, it's warm. I just, you know what? Can we do an interview? You know, I don't feel appreciated by Ross, okay? We were freezing last night. The fire had went out. I thought I'd do something nice and go kill, you know, a deer or a wolf. And I had the weapons. I had the Tide Pod and the workout thing, okay? I had everything I needed to kill an animal, okay? I skinned it. So I spent all last night sewing it while he slept, okay? I, th I thought he'd wake up and be more appreciative. He's a asshole. All right, guys, it is time to make a shelter. What we're going to do is take all these sticks right here and lean them up against this, uh, this log and hopefully have a nice little teepee underneath here. Uh, so here we go. Ross! Ah! Ross! Ah! You okay? I'm worried about you! Ah! Ross, what happened? I don't know, it hurts. Did you break your arm? No, I think I cut it really bad though. <sighs> I got something for it, I got something for it. Ah. Calm down, calm down. Here, rub a little bit of this KY jelly on it. It'll take care of it, here. Why do you have KY jelly? It's got like a thousand uses. And I'm not getting no love out here in the wilderness. I had to do something. Rub it on, get up here. You sure it's gonna work? It, it'll work. Can you come down here, help me out? No, I'm not coming down there. It's not life or death. No, it hurts. Your legs ain't hurt, are they? No, they hurt. Get up. They, they're sore, but they're not broke. Get up here. How's your arm feeling? Honestly, it's feeling a little bit better. KY helped more than I thought. Good. Hey, we're almost done here, so. Told you. Probably get out of the wind a little bit. What are you doing? Just giving it a little bit of life. That looks cute. Why do you keep bringing things? That don't help us, Tammy. The, what's this hurting? It Tammy, you brought lights to decorate. We don't even have electricity. We don't gotta plug it in. It looks it looks cute as is. Damn it, Tammy, I'm not Get out of it! Damn! Freaking out of it! Relax! No! 
been pouring my heart out in this damn survival, and you're doing nothing. I'm no. doing. I'm doing nothing. Hey, you better freaking relax. I'm doing nothing, Russ. I've done everything. Who you ate? Done anything. Who ate? Cause of me. No, I haven't eaten anything you, to eat. You ate half that pizza. You ate half I'm that. I'm starving. Pizza. You ate half the bag of chips. We wouldn't have had, had a fire a without me. Okay. You, you got warm. lucky with the Tide Pod. You okay. brought it for a damn snack. Okay. What about? What about the? What about what? Nothing. I thought you were a survival expert, okay? I am trying. What? You're, you're you bringing put, me you down. You put some sticks up against another big stick? It don't even break wind, Ross. The only thing breaking wind out here is you, Tammy. It's you. Okay. Yeah, you're right. Well, Ross just had a mental breakdown, okay? I've never been around nothing like that before, all right? And to be honest with you, I think he's jealous. I think he's... Used to being the big wig, you know. He's used to making the fire and the food, all that, all that. You know, he hadn't been able to do none of that this trip. It's been me, okay. We wouldn't have ate if it weren't for me. We wouldn't have had a fire if it weren't for me. And I think he's pissed about that. So he had a breakdown on me. Guys, I've had about enough of this. I'm, I'm this close to calling it. My partner's a cancer. I mean, she doesn't bring anything to the table. I'm doing something for five minutes. She comes back, she's got a pizza. We're three hours into the woods. Where the hell does she get a pizza? Where does she get KY jelly? Where does she get lights? Where does she get Tide Pods? Where does she, what, who is she? I don't get it. This isn't survival to me. This is, this is magic. Oh, damn it. Yeah. Well, Sorry about what I did earlier. Don't worry about it, man. Okay, it's, it, we're good. I was out of line, freaking out. Just this the stress got to me cold. I know. Lack of food. I know. But um, you ate half a pizza, but I I know what you mean. Yeah, I understand. It, hey, we're we're good. Oh. Our twenty four hours is up. Let's get out of here. Oh my, let's go. Oh my god. Woo! Hell let's yeah, go. Dog. Let's go. Oh. All right. Yeah. Man, that was that was fun, wasn't it? Yeah. I had a blast. I made a lifelong friend. Yeah, you know what? I, it was hard, but we, it was hard. I'm proud of us. Yeah, I'm proud of us too. Hey, yeah, gotta get your phone number. Thanks for watching the video. If you guys want to see more videos like that, make sure to subscribe to my channel right here. Make sure to check out our last video right here. We did a pretty good job surviving, didn't we? If you like Chelsea, check out her channel in the description too. Have a great day. It is freezing out here. <laughs>